Hey guys, Mabuhay! Today we're going to discuss geometric sequence. Without further ado, let's get started. A series is the sum of terms in a series while the sequence is a list of numbers that is ordered or have a definite pattern. For example, 2, 6, 18, 54 is a sequence. We just have to multiply a fixed amount which is not equal to 0 to the first term to be able to arrive at the second term since it has a definite pattern. For example, with a common ratio of 3, we have to multiply 2 by 3 to get 6, 6 by 3 to get 18, 18 by 3 to get 54. As we multiply the fixed amount or the common ratio to the following term, we will come up with a geometric sequence. To get the common ratio in a geometric sequence, we just have to divide the third term by the second term, second term by the first term. For example, given 2, 6, 18, 18 divided by 6 is 3, and 6 divided by 2 is 3. Let's have another example. With a common ratio of 3, we just have to multiply the first term by 3 to arrive at the second term and so on. For instance, 1 times 3 equals 3. 3 times 3 equals 9. 9 times 3 equals 27 and so on. We get 3, 9, 27 and its pattern. To find any term in a geometric sequence, a formula is used. a sub n equals a sub 1 times r raised to n minus 1. Find the sixth term of the sequence 5, 15, 45, 135. n is 6, a sub 1 is 5, and r is equal to 3. We get a sub 6 equals 5 times 3 raised to 6 minus 1. The answer is 1215. To find the sum of the terms in a geometric sequence, a formula is used. S sub n equals a sub 1 times quantity 1 minus r raised to n all over 1 minus r. Example Find the sum of the first five terms of the sequence 5, 15, 45. We use the formula and substituting the values we get s sub 5 equals 5 times quantity 1 minus 3 raised to 5 all over 1 minus 3. We get the answer 605. That's all for geometric sequence. If you have any questions, drop them down in the comments below. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe for more tutorials.